Hi, I'm Jeff Sickinga, Executive Director of the Ashbrook Center. In the spirit of this season, I'd like to share with you a very special Christmas story. The story of a boy whose father gave him the gift of America. Peter Schramm was born in Soviet-occupied Hungary in 1946. Before the age of 10, his father had been imprisoned. His grandfather sent to a work camp for nothing more than possessing an American flag and his family-owned business seized by the communists. One day, as the revolution against communism was failing, Peter's father came home and announced that the family was leaving Hungary. Peter, then only a boy of nine years, asked his father where they were going. We're going to America, his father said. Why America, young Peter wondered. Because, son, we were born Americans but in the wrong place. With only $17 to their names and a few small bags of clothes, Peter's family fled quietly, telling neither family nor friends where they were going. And on Christmas Eve, after weeks of fleeing the grasp of tyranny and oppression across the continent of Europe, young Peter and his family arrived in America, in New York Harbor. Can you imagine what it must have been like that night? To see Lady Liberty raise the light of freedom up on the holiest of all nights, giving hope to the hopeless, liberty to the oppressed, and freedom to those yearning to be free. And so, on that most special of Christmases, Peter's parents gave him a gift he would spend the rest of his life trying to repay, the gift of freedom. Out of love for America, Peter devoted his life to studying and teaching those of us who happen to be born here why ours is a country worth loving. Here at Ashbrook, Peter became the executive director and led the organization to new heights, reaching students, teachers, and citizens in all 50 states. It's hard for us who were born here to understand how powerful this story is. It's hard to fathom the indescribable hope the Schramm family needed in order to leave everything behind in search of a better life. And how poetic it is that they arrived on these shores on the very day that best embodies hope for all mankind. I trust this story renews a sense of hope in you today. Hope in America. Hope in the freedom we have. Hope in the great principles that have united us as one people since our founding. And so, from all of us here at Ashbrook, we want to wish you a Merry Christmas and a hopeful New Year.